get this started. Now, let's see who goes first. Would you like to play some poker? Sure. All right. Yeah. Yeah. Let me show you the, yeah, how we're going to do this. The wonderful ways of poker with these. All right. Come on. I'm seeing three threes. Okay. Yeah. You got this. On the other hand, you have three fives. So, your choice? I'll go first. All right. Hey, all right, so then you guys are Something like that. And then where did I set mine? I too shall be origin. Uh -huh. oh, sounds good. Here's Snake Eyes. Before Unamas. All right, you're fucking. What do you say? I'll keep it. Let's do this. Might as well, right? Yeah. And there it is. Want some team? Oh, yeah. Show me your thoughtsies? Yeah. So, sliver high? So, and if you need to know what that does. So, like quite a colorless. You can pay five, make a token. And yeah. As long as I can wall. Um, I guess by curve is that. So either vile striking slip or uh vile first strike vigilance spell pierce. <laughs> That's basically what that is. Take four. 
13. Yeah, I'm gonna make phase two. I'm gonna cast Inquisition of Cousin like Target. Another Sentinel and Diffusion Slider. So what effect do you think these t new Tango Tango lands are having on going to have on water? Well, the battle land. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. Um, I think that they might go into some control decks. I can imagine, like, if you thought of Legacy. The Miracle decks have so many basics that they might actually be able to get away with it. If you're fetching and you know that you don't need it to come in uh, untapped anyway, you go get that instead. In modern, because it's a, it seems. I feel like modern is like even like actually a faster format of legacy. Is. I think on average it is. Although the potential for legacy to be faster is there. Yeah, you've got people comboing. Yeah. Yeah. Turn zero, blah blah blah. A devile. Drop. Sentinel. See now, I like the premise of the Battlelands, but my worry is that what happens when I'm desperately needed to top deck and untap the number, and I have like, you know, a godless and an isolated and a plans. Definitely. I can see some two-color control decks, perhaps, that run them. Uh, if they already have a fair number of basics. Mm -hmm. uh, like, I can see maybe, like, a, let's see, blue-white is running fetches, as, so four of the hallowed, uh, not hallowed, the uh, flooded strands, four hallowed fountain, four celestial colonnade, that's 12. Basics, if you had even one, that's 13 plus basics, but then you're probably actually running. Um, some glacial fortresses or something like that too. It, yeah. they, they lose that value really quickly if you're not careful. Uh, come on. Three near you. Yeah. So, so I, okay. I'll go to nine. Pass turn. End of turn. Flash in menace. So menace, vigilance, help pierce. Okay, sounds good to you. Lord? Mm. Okay. Combat? They can't be blocked? Can't watch some Because of menace. Two or more right now. Okay. Alright, so. Seven? The end of combat. Or the end of attackers and the cast raise. Okay. You should divide. These are the ones that are attacking this one. It's not. Yeah. Okay. How would you like to do this? Throw a blood in the sliver and say, Fuck out of it. Go to three. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay. And then pass turn. Yeah. Yeah! Uh, a little counter it, Jamie! Oh, uh, the creep here. Come on, counter it, Jamie! Oh! Yeah, yeah, pass. Go. Yeah! Yeah! 
In Hearthstone, when you yeah. have bonus toughness, any damage is first marked on the bonus toughness, and then. Fair enough. So, I was actually curious how that would work. Double um, Sentinel? Yeah. Last check? Yep. Oh boy. I figured that even somehow, like if I, if you top deck to Soren, then Soren would be dead at that point if I just got rid of all the creatures. Yeah. I mean, well, I mean not really dead. You make another token, but then I have yeah. two creatures. And yeah, you got it. You know how that works. Yeah, I would trade with one, be at one, trade with the other, and yeah, that would be. I mean, sword, sword's good. I mean, okay, yeah. <laughs> stop back three lands in a row. Not. All right, Cody, I don't like that big dog ball. Have a good night, boss. Maybe you are. Yep, I'm oh, going to play. That is another thing about this deck that makes it a little bit less awesome. Uh, you have to mulligan more than you'd like to be sure. Mm -hmm. This on the other hand. I'll keep this. Likewise, yeah. Let's do this. Oh, yeah. Okay. I wish I'd play Wild Eye Club. What about yeah. First strike? Pass turn. Pass turn. Pass turn. Pass turn. Guess this will do. Yeah. 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 
I'll play reveal. And then I'll cast lingering song. Here we go. Dark Souls have a story, you guys. So have you, you played Dark Souls before, right? We, we had this discussion. Yeah, I played it for like four or five hours. I lost all my souls, and then I lost all my souls, and then I quit. <laughs> I'll do it. Okay, so if you had not gotten that, then I still have a turn for a kill, but now you have blockers. That makes it kind of awkward. No. Combat? Mm -hmm. Swing 9? Or excuse me, swing 12? Well, I'll block 8 of it in second 4. There we go. How's it turn? I'm just going to be fetching one here and there. We'll see if I live. I'm hanging on for a little while longer. Flashback Lingering Souls. Yeah. I have to get the menace sliver to kill you this time, I think. And then I'll pass turn. What do we got? 14? Yeah. A shock, turn one. It's 18. And then. Two. Played this one for six, I double block. That's right. Um, you so you no, I did. I did take. I took two more earlier because I took two the turn you played this, okay. or the turn you swung with this and played this. So I took two there, and then the turn, the turn after you swung six, I blocked, and then you swung. Oh, well, hopefully it won't matter. Anyway. Yeah. Like the best play. I should have. That's what I should have done. I guess. One thing I'm missing in this deck is I don't have the indestructible sliver. So I, I did not expect Rapid Dog to come out of the token deck, though. But I guess I can see that. You know. You, yeah. You usually, have, anything you play is worth more to me than my link results token. Fair enough. Especially if you can cast them back from, their, from the graveyard. Yeah. All right. So I sided playing nothing that showed up in that game. Yeah, I sided out my two dismembers for two rats. I sided in two harmonic slivers, bringing up to three yeah. in, in the deck, and then a spinner rat just for another form of reach. Uh, I bring yeah. this in against Dover, against tokens, and just any time I think I might need flying. It's Gale Rider number, well, it's not quite Gale Rider number five. It actually is a 2 2, so it can block Dover. Yeah, yeah. It can block Insect Tunnel Apparition, I guess. Mm -hmm. And this is it. And I sided out. The haste slivers and a diffusion. One. It, it's still leaving me with three. Um, I don't think you're quite as removal ahead. Well, targeted removal ahead anyway. I mean, I run you know, like standard package, like yeah. four paths and three as members. I don't run anything else. Like, I don't run Vendetta or anything. Yeah, I'm not that suicidal. It's not like a, a gen deck where it's like four bolts and four dispenders and four abrupt decays and four. Coladon's Command, before Terminate, I'm exaggerating, but you get the point. 
Well, yeah, yeah, it's, it's all on the list. It's just not exactly yeah. they play all of this stuff at once. Yeah. All right. Yeah. All right. So there's that.